This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is a Warlock brand, model TL10 Tractor Trailer Door Lock. This is a fairly heavy lock, weighing in at about 3 pounds. It's made of cast steel, and designed to both lock and envelop the latch of a standard trailer door. The core is a disc detainer design, and normally this portion of the lock would be covered with a rubber cap. This lock has obviously seen some heavy use, and that cap has been lost to time. Unfortunately, that means that the inside of this lock has accumulated a great deal of grit and grime from the road, which is going to make this considerably harder to pick. So we have our work cut out for us. Let's see what it takes to get this open. The first thing we'll do is rotate all of the discs as far clockwise as they will go. Then I'm going to insert this pick and try to pick up disc number one. I should note that this is a rear tensioning lock, which means we'll have to use a somewhat more advanced technique to open this up with a front tensioning tool. Okay, tensioning off of one, two is loose, so is three, four, little click out of five, six is loose, seven, I got a click out of seven there. And nothing on eight. Let's go back. Just work our way back. Eight, seven, six, binding. Got a nice click out of six. Number five. Oh, five feels like it's in a gate right now. Four is binding. Nice click out of four. Click out of three. Nothing on two. Okay, let's work our way back. Actually, number two, maybe two is binding. It's strange, it's going in and out of binding. Maybe I'm rubbing into a piece of grit in there. But I feel like I'm in a gate now. Number three is binding. Three feels like it's in a gate now. Four is, it's hard to say what four is doing right now. Four is staying still like it's in a gate. I'll leave him alone for now. Nothing on five, six, seven. Let's actually just check to see if everything is picked. I'll do that by going to disc eight, tensioning it some counter rotation on and yep everything was in a gate and we got this open so even with all the grit inside of here it wasn't that hard to open though it certainly was more time consuming than it might normally be even so i don't think that picking is a likely real world threat for a lock like this in any case that's all i have for you today if you do have any questions or comments about this please put them below if you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe, and as always, have a nice day. Thank you.